did that happen? Jesus Christ. I'll look for something to start a fire. Stop looking at me, motherfucker. What do you want? Jesus. We should have gone around. God damn it. We should have just fucking gone around. The ice was too thin. I couldn't reach him. Once that ice started to go, there wasn't nothing any of us could do. You son of a bitch. This is your fucking fault. Kenny, don't, man. Don't what? It's nobody's damn fault. The hell it ain't. Look at this place. Just a stack of fucking toothpicks. Bet those magical supplies are bullshit too. What? No speaking of English? That's that's Spanish. Fuck you. Oh, oh, this dude can speak English. Call me piece of shit, Kenny. Fuck you. All right, maybe. Okay, Kenny, maybe you don't. At that time, I'm going to raise my voice on Kenny a little bit. What did you do to him? There's another just like it. He wasn't lying. You want to tell me how a can of fucking chili is going to help How is baby? beating a kid to death going to help anyone? Tying him up. Fine. Mike, help me get a fire started. You okay? He's hurt real bad. Mike. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Uh, uh, uh. You got a light? What? What do you want? You want some? I thought I had You should be glad I pulled Kenny off you, buddy. Why would I throw it away? Where is AJ? Where's the baby? Who's holding the baby right now? Where is he? Take a look at you, kid. Jesus. He could have killed you. What the fuck is wrong with him? You're up. Huh. Hey. Kenny's out back trying to get some stupid truck started. Oh no, not the yeah. not it's the RV all something. over again. You okay? Did we at least warm the chili up using the fire that we have, or are we just gonna eat it raw I can't and cold? He's gone. Yeah, I can't believe Bonnie killed him either. That's I crazy. People before, but That's crazy that Bonnie walked over there and just killed us. Luke when he wasn't gonna die. In a while. He was a great guy. God damn it! Isn't that just crazy that Bonnie walked over there and like basically just shot Luke in the chest and herself too while we're at it? We'll be okay. Trust me. If you say so. I'm gonna find something to clean that up. Thank you. Thank you. I can't take this shit anymore. Feeling better? Yeah. Hell of a day. Where the hell is the kid at? Where is he? But we gotta get moving. If you're feeling oh, is he in, oh, he's in the box right there. I see him. Okay. 
This house ain't worth the crap, but the vehicles ain't in bad shape. Yeah, sure, Kenny. That's the spirit, darling. I'll wait for you out back. I'll watch him. Clem. What? Just be careful. Is that truck at all functional? Even a little bit? What did she have to say? I know she was running her mouth. What did she say? You shouldn't have done that to Arvo. I know. I know, Clem, but, but Luke... I don't care. You can't do that. Jesus, Clem. You know me. You know I'm not like that. Yeah, but Kenny, I'm gonna have to... Kenny, I'm gonna have to tell you the truth. That was a little bit too much. I don't like Arvo either. Fuck him personally, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Scared all of us, Kenny. Luke falling wasn't his what fault. It again? was Bonnie's fault. That's a promise. The reason Luke is dead is because of Bonnie. <sighs> what happened? It's over. But AJ needs us now. We gotta stick together on this thing. All right? Come on. Let's see if the truck's gonna go. I would think not. Is any? Is there? A, yeah. My daddy always had a half dozen wrecks he was fixing up. He was a mean son of a bitch, but he taught me respect. A girl like Jane could learn a thing or two about that. We we're all just tired. Hell, I've been tired for two years. Same. All right, give it a turn. We're so close, Clem. With a little bit of luck, I can get this thing running, and then we can get out on the road and really make some distance. Wellington's got to be out there. Now, those rumors can't all be bunk. What about Mexico? I mean, hell, there's got to be something out here other than snow and goddamn Euro trash. What about Mexico? Why? You want a taco? I've <laughs> never been there. I went once, a long time ago, just before I met Ken. The fuck were you doing in Mexico, Kenny? You speak Spanish? All right, turn it again. Did you turn it? Yes. God damn it. <sighs> Kenny, are you okay? We got to I mean, get moving if we're going to keep aging. We know the alive. answer to that question. The answer is no. We're running out of time. I got to get this thing to start. Going to try warming up the battery. Go on inside. I don't like leaving him with that girl. Need any help? I'm fine. Go check on AJ. Okay. Wish they'd finished this place. Be nice. Who's building a house out here, by the way? We're in West Virginia.
Nick and Arvo wouldn't shut up, so I moved him in here. Ah. God damn it. <laughs> Seen that look before. I mean, that's normal. He's trying to fix the car. He'll be fine. Clem, he beat that boy within an inch of his life. No, he didn't. We are way past fine. I know Kenny's a nice guy, Clem. I bet Carver was a nice guy, too. Once. Probably had a nice job, and a nice pretty wife. Then all this happened. And one day, he caved some kid's face in and realized he could sleep at night. I think the baby's- I think the baby can understand you. Kenny isn't Carver. He just made a mistake. All I'm saying is, start thinking about what happens if you're wrong. You two have known each other a long time. Sooner or later, you're gonna have to decide how much that's worth. I think it needs food or something. Seems like you've done that before. If the kid was hungry, it w he, he wouldn't just stop crying. You want to try? No way. It's going to puke. Clem, no. No, she says as she takes the baby. Like this. Hey. Hi. <laughs> My name's Jane. I think it's going to puke. It's not going to puke. <coughs> it puked. Uh, that, it puked. That was blood. Gross. They did just they did just use the coughing animation from from someone's turning for that. Oh. There's not much left. I was running with some Also, it's time. probably cold as shit too. Some guy got Can't warm that over the fire. Walk. Can't remember his name. He used to call me Mary Jane. He was a douchebag. Real creative dude. Anyway, the dick got stuck under a car hiding from a dozen walkers. One after another, they went down there trying to save him. Lost four people before we got him out. All that for one person? That's what I'm saying. Didn't find out till later he was already bit. Turn and ripped the neck right out of this old lady. The look on her face was... She was just staring up at the sky. Like she was watching a bird. Look, Clem. Oh, he got it. He got it working. It works. What I tell you. How much gas it got? So what's the plan? How much food do we have? At least a week. And for the baby? We need to find a place for the baby. Yeah, some place warm. I agree. We should head back south. What? We're kind of freeze to death. I don't know whose stupid idea it was to march up here in the first place, but it was a bad one. She's Jane, right. how did you get up here? Back to house. Wait, what? Fuck that. I was thinking more like Texas. Texas? What the fuck? It was just an idea. How's this probably overran with Walker still? This. I'm sorry. We did? We're going to find Wellington. Right, Clem? Wellington? Kenny, it's freezing up here, man. It's only gonna get worse. We came this far. We're not going back. Nah, man, this is fucking nuts. I'm with Kenny. We should head north. Yeah, let's God go north. Damn right. Clem. I have two reasons. I well, the Wellington thing, the Wellington thing aside, the reason I want to go north is because walkers can't walkers should freeze up in, in the north. And going back south is not a good idea. Where it'll be nice and warm. She told me about Wellington a long time ago, Jane. It's out there. Look, I don't give two shits about what you people think. I got this truck working, so I say where we go. And we're heading fucking north. It's the best chance we got of helping AJ. What about Arbo? Who? Oh, the Rusky? Yeah, he ain't coming with us. You're just gonna leave him here? I don't give a good goddamn where he goes. He's done. He could die. I don't like Arvo. At this point, you might be right. He knows the area. 
He can help us. Oh yeah, some help he's been. He got Luke killed. I ain't no, Bonnie did before. that. But maybe if you'd eased up on him before, he wouldn't have run away in the first place. You ever think about that, Kenny? Either way, I'm not going anywhere in the middle of the night. Yeah, me neither. There could be a herd out there. You want that child's blood on your hands, Mike? We're all gonna die out here if you don't calm the fuck down, Kenny. Haven't we been through enough for one day? Jesus fucking Christ. Remember the last time we had a working car and sat around on our asses, Clem? I'm going inside. Yeah, she's right. He's right. I don't know how long the RV was fixed, but we just just wait around God while we had it. Damn it! Kenny, are you okay? You better talk some sense into him. For his sake. I mean, we don't have to leave tonight. We can wait till the morning. God damn it. God damn it. That stupid fucking. What is he mad about now? Get the fuck out of here. It's me. Clem. Sorry. Just give me a second. Kenny, you shouldn't poke around at that. Just saying. Can you believe this, Clem? I bring him a working truck. And they act like I just shit in their cereal. I knew Jane would have a stick up her ass, but I thought at least Mike would have more sense. He's turned out to be a real disappointment. Well, why can't we just leave tomorrow? Look, we got maybe a day's worth of food for that kid left. That's it. Clem, think about Rebecca and Alvin. I mean, what if Lee hadn't gone tearing across half of Georgia looking for you? A lot of folks died to make that happen. A lot of folks died to get us this far. We owe it to them to see this done. I know, you're right. Someone's gotta keep this group together. That kid's depending on us. <sighs> I wish Lee was here. I wish Lee was here too. What'd you think he'd say? I think he'd tell me to try to keep the group together and to keep my hair short. We can't just give up on this kid. I mean, what's the point of going on after that? That's what people like Lee knew and what people like Jane won't ever understand. His 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 um I know Wellington. His conflict with Jane is pretty kind of random. The two of them didn't interact that much to begin with. Krista heard about it too, right? Yeah. You know, when I first saw you back at that lodge, I thought I was dreaming. And when you sat down next to me and we shared that meal, well, I could tell that you were different now. Grown up. I, I felt pride. A pride I hadn't felt in a long time. But I need you now, Clem. There have to be folks doing better than us. It's the only chance that child has. Yeah, but we can't do it alone. We need the others. And that's why I gotta be able to count on you, Clem. We gotta convince him. You and me. Look, we'll figure everything out in the morning. Okay, so we can leave tomorrow. Good. Come on. Let's get some sleep. I do agree. So driving driving at night is not a good idea. Going on. Oh, yeah. So you're gonna you're gonna take half the supplies in the truck and just dip? Who's there? Hey Mike, turn around, brother. He 
Easy. Easy now. Step back. Clown. Shit. What are you doing? We're just leaving. Now keep it down, all right? That's everything we have. Oh, that's everything. Oh, you guys are pieces of shit. Listen, we just gotta get away from that guy, clown. Okay? Okay, well, you guys can walk. Who? Leave can the car you? and leave the bag. Clown. Damn it, just... We don't have time for this. All right. What the fuck you doing? Walk up to you nice and slow, and you're gonna give me the gun. Okay? No, the fuck I'm not. Kenny, Jane, help! They're robbing us. Oh! No! You piece of shit. Hey, you better run.